Eyes are watching, ears are listening, voices quiet, bodies calm. This is how we listen, this is how we listen at group time, at group time. Thank you for joining us for our story time. Before we read our story, let's do some good breaths. So, because our letter this week is B, we're going to do today, let's do bunny breaths. Okay, so remember always, whenever we take our big breaths, we breathe in through our nose and out through our mouth. But this time, we're gonna make bunny ears when we breathe in and put them down when we breathe out. Are you ready? Let's do it together. Ready? Good. We're going to do it one more time. Do it with me. Make your bunny ears. Here they are. Ready? Big breath in. That should hopefully make you feel a little more calm and relaxed and ready to hear our story. Our story today is one of my favorites. It's called Fill a Bucket. Look, there's a B in our title, Bucket. Fill a Bucket. Look at this bucket. Oh, wow, look at all those colorful things inside that bucket. I wonder what we're gonna fill the bucket with. Hmm. The author of this book actually has two people. There's two authors, so two people helped write the words. It was Carol McLeod and Catherine Martin. They both helped each other write the words of the book. And the illustrator is David Messing. That means David Messing drew the pictures in this story. So let's read the book together and find out what they're going to fill the bucket with. Fill a Bucket by Carol McLeod and Katherine Martin, illustrated by David Messing. If you look in this book, you see a song here. We'll come back to that at the end so we can hear what that song is, but let's read this story first. The day you were born was a very happy day. It was your birthday, a day you celebrate every year. Just like we celebrated Micah's birthday today. Everyone has a birthday. You were a new person and a special gift. You received a gift too, your very own name a name as special as you. What is your name? My name is Abby. That is my special name. Everyone was so happy to see you, but there was one part of you that they could not see. It was your bucket your invisible bucket. See, we can see the bucket, but the people can't see the bucket. It's invisible, which means it's, some, it's something that's there, but you can't see it. Everyone is born with an invisible bucket. No one can see your bucket, but it is always with you. Your bucket is a very important part of you. It is an important part of everyone. See all the people, they all, have, look, even the cat and the dog, the, everyone has their own bucket. But no one can see them, they're invisible. Only we can see them right now because we are reading this special book. Your bucket holds all the love and happiness you receive each day. When your bucket is full, see how it's full? You feel happy when your bucket is empty. You feel sad. It's good to have a full bucket. 
Every day, your family and lots of other people help fill your bucket. When your daddy kisses and tickles you, he fills your bucket. Your giggles fill his bucket. So when you're playing with your family, everyone's bucket is getting filled up. When your mommy smiles and tells you she loves you, she is filling your bucket. And your smiles fill her bucket too. So when you're sharing with your grown-ups hugs and smiles, that fills your bucket and it fills their bucket. When your sister or your brother snuggles and reads to you, your buckets fill up even more. When your grandpa or your grandma plays with you, everyone's bucket is filled. Look, they're blowing bubbles and they're smiling. They're filling each other's buckets. Look, he's trying to pop the bubbles pop 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 look your bucket is so full it is full of happy thoughts and lots of love so many people have filled your bucket you can fill their buckets too how could we fill their buckets what do you think we could do to fill everyone else's buckets Bucket filling is like magic. When you fill a bucket by being kind and loving, your bucket fills up too. So you can help fill your own bucket and other people's buckets. So when you're doing kind things and you're showing how much you love other people, your bucket fills up along with theirs. You can do so many things to fill buckets every day. When you listen and help, you are filling a bucket. Your bucket fills up more. Look, looks like he's helping clean up the toys. That is making his grown-up happy. She's smiling, so that means her bucket is filling and you're, he's smiling, so his bucket is filling up. When you say please and thank you, your magic words fill buckets. When you play and share your toys, everyone is happy. Everyone's invisible bucket is filled. When you take care of your pet, you are filling a bucket. Your bucket fills up too. When you smile and wave to those you see, you are being a bucket filler. Are you a bucket filler? Do you help fill people's buckets? Do you wave and smile and help take care of your pets? When you give hugs and kisses, your love fills buckets. It's good to go to sleep with a bucket full of happiness and love. Look, look at all the happy faces. Everyone's bucket is full. Now it's your turn. What can you do to fill a bucket today? That was the end of our story. Let's go back to the beginning here where there was a song. I'd like to sing the song with you. Maybe this is a song that you can learn or your grown up can help you find on maybe on the internet. So let's sing it. It goes like this. Fill a bucket, fill a bucket every day, every day. I can fill a bucket, I can fill a bucket, you can too, you can too.
fill a bucket, fill a bucket every day, every day. I like filling buckets, I like filling buckets, you will too, you will too. It is so much fun to fill a bucket. I hope you fill lots of buckets today.